Hey planner babes, it's Mandy from Create with Mandy and I wanted to show you the minimalist line. So I just got this in my squad box and I wanted to go ahead and flip through the whole collection, give you my thoughts about it. Super excited. This is the um, Happy Planner Girl that I wanted so I'm super glad that I got her. And so let me go ahead and flip through the stuff. So first thing is the planner. So this is an awesome new like design or whatever that they chose to do, which is this um, like pleather flexible cover, these new um, deluxe covers. So it's really cool to snap in. I actually, it's growing on me a lot more than I thought it would. I like this color in here as well. And I, it's just growing on me. So what is coming is better than what is gone. So super nice you open it up and it's not any it's not really different than a regular cover to flip through um, or you know open it's just different yeah so it's a vertical layout minimalist happy planner belongs to for your name here you go and I love this like pattern here um, very cool minimal I love it and you have the yearly view, the perpetual calendar, that's nice. And then here's the first divider. So let me show you the dashboard on the side here. So this is new, I've never seen this layout for the dashboard before. So it says noted, this month's focus, special dates and holidays to do, and then this month I'm grateful for. I like it, it's nice and simple and clean, perfect, kind of goes with the minimalist theme obviously so January nice black and white here we go into the month it's nice I love this font it's super nice professional looking ish I don't know I just like that font uh, so super normal um, monthly then we go into the week super nice and clean there is a pop of color on each line here which I don't think it's too bad at all. It's super subtle. It's like a nice like pastel with like gray in it. So not exactly pastel. Um, super nice. Love the font again. Super simple. I really like it. And so that is for all of January. Get that same blue. February. Cute divider. And then you go into pink. And then you get the pink on the week. So this is actually much darker than this pink. It's more like a coral, but I use pink all the time, so I don't mind it again. Then here is March. It's like a really nice subtle green, like you can barely even tell. Same green here. Then on the weeks, you have that again on the lines. Again, subtle. And then from there, I believe it goes back to the blue. So it goes blue, pink, and green. You are so great. I love that texture in the background. So again, we don't need to flip through the weeks. And then we're in May. Love that. These dividers are really pretty. Love them. Definitely going to make it super hard for me to pick my 2021 planner. September. October. It's cool. I like that. November. December. You got that notes page with that cool texture, minimalist logo down here, and again the cover on the back. Super nice. I like it. I also like that it feels a little more bendy than with um, the normal covers, so I really like that about it. Um, I like flexible not that I have any reason for it but I just like that okay so the other accessories in this collection you get the sticker book the tiny sticker pad and then there is some filler paper so let me go ahead and open this up real quick let me pull out just a couple or one so it says today there's a nice space for the date up here one, two, three, notes to do. I like how skinny these lines are, super nice. And then the back is just pink with dotted, or just lines, they're not dotted lines. 
super nice. I love how simple it is, very professional looking. I really like this so much um, and so much more than I thought too. So that is really nice. Okay, and then of course the best part is the sticker. So let me go ahead and go through the tiny pad first. Open up the tape on the sides. Let's see. Okay. All right. Love, love it already. Love the texture, so cool. Very excited. Ooh, nice simple boxes. They have a nice lineup there. You could put the date in there. Yes, loving this. And this is actually my first time looking at any of this. I have shielded my eyes from everyone else who's been flipping through. Love that, that's so cool and different. I love different stickers, um, just like, I don't know, maybe that's just why I think it's so cool is because I haven't seen it before, but love these. Yes, so cool. So cool, I love, love that texture, the pattern, the colors. Those are a little bit more bright and normal. And these guys, these guys look um, like narrower than the usual ones. Curious to see where they fit. Yes, I like those. That's super nice and elegant looking. Yes. More boxes. This one is probably like my favorite thing so far. That one's nice too. Again, I'm like obsessed with that textured pattern now. So many in here. Okay, and that's it. Cool. So that is the tiny sticker pad. Next is the sticker book. Super excited. Again, have not flipped through this, so this is literally the first time. Okay, so these are, you know, similar to the tiny pad, but obviously you're gonna get a lot of the little ones in the main book. Yes, love this, this is so cool. Um, those gold like dots, looks like paint splatter. Very cool. Some really simple like functional items, that's cool. It's like a long narrow um, rectangle with like a line of color at an angle there. So that's interesting. Okay, I think I got that. All right, some priorities boxes, some hexagons. These guys, interesting. Cool new shapes of like headers. Here's those same um, boxes that's in here, but without the pattern in there, a texture. Ooh, look at that weekly checklist. Love the font, it's so good. So glad I got this collection. Out of office, so cute. Interesting, some rounded ones. Some more headers. Uh, this says appointment, location, positive word, personal challenge, make time to, I am, and then you put an affirmation, positive word, and do this week. Cool. Some nice headers. I love the little like swipe of a marker underneath there, and these are clear. Super nice. Some plain boxes with a really thin line. It's too small to like write in that white spot. So I think it's just, you write in like the whole, the whole box. And there's just happened to be white spots there. I, that's so hard to explain, but I feel like I will totally show you guys when I use these stickers of like what I'm envisioning for that one. Take what you need today. Oh, cute. Patience, hope, gratitude, forgiveness, happiness, inspiration, confidence, and encouragement. Super cute. Love the color palette. It's really nice. Some checklists. This thing again, but with different colors. So there's like a little bit of green and that cool texture in the background. Awesome. It looks like the same stickers actually. 
Let me just go check. I feel like I noticed that stuff. Yeah, so those are the same stickers, just in a pink with some rose gold, it looks like. And then with this colors, and there's no foil in there. That'll definitely come in handy. Definitely like to have the duplicates for the stuff that I use a lot. Nice. Okay, it looks like similar stickers in the second half, but with the with the uh, cool toned palette. That's just my guess so far. Okay, these are new. This is very important. Some nice clear stickers. I, have, I notice a lot of these are very functional. See, here's a cool tone palette. Some clear quotes and stuff. More of these checklists. Boxes. Man, this one also is there's so much to it. Clear stickers. Here's these same things again, but these have the foil on them. More boxes. And that's it. So that is minimalist. Super nice, super functional for everyone who loves functional and then for everyone who loves more neutral palette or just softer colors like me. This is so perfect. I love it so much. So here's the collection. One more time. Let me just take that off. Super awesome. Let me know what you think below. And if you're going to grab anything from this collection, I would love to know what you're going to get. So I'll go ahead and see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.